Hey smart minds, get ready for a game changer. There's a new feature that's about to completely revolutionize your Scratch experience. Real-time collaboration. Right in the heart of normal Scratch. No mods, nothing. Just a mind-blowing feature we all been waiting for. To start things off, you need to download the Block Live extension from the Chrome slash Edge web store. Links in the description below. And then it will redirect you to this page and then install it. Once installed, you're basically done. But there's a small catch. Your collaborators, which you will be working in the project, need this extension too. So yeah, all of you must have this extension for seamless real-time collaboration. So once you're all set up, open a project, click see inside, and there it is, the block light button. Once you click it, you can add your friends as collaborators by typing in their username and hitting enter. Really simple. So once you add your friends as collaborators, your friends should do the same. So click on the extensions and you will find the block live extension paid for easy access. And then click on it. Then you'll see all your allow lists. So make sure you add your friends. So let's add Rehan Scratch. There we go. So for this demo, I got two tabs with two different accounts because I got no friends. And now if you share the project, your collaborators will see a new project with a pink title, really important, in their My Stuff category. Pink means that it's shared. And now, the fun begins. Click on the project and you can collaboratively work on it. So as you can see, now I got both of my accounts on the same project. This is, this is really crazy. So let me just move around the project and you could see the profile pictures where your collaborators are working and it updates pretty much instantly. So on my left is my main account which I share the project and on my right is the collaborator which is also me. So you will see this small profile picture which indicates where each user is. Really really cool. Also you could click on any of the profile pictures to teleport. When I'm moving the blocks it constantly updates really really cool. Like look at this. This is like magic. This is so awesome. Wow, you did look at that. So now let's just make a change. I'll go to costumes and I'll just replace Pikachu to another sprite. So once your collaborators edit your code, you would see the same code. And more importantly, the output will be the same. This is so cool, man. Scratch is making Scratch better than the Scratch team. I love it. And the best thing is there's no delay in between. So everything updates pretty much instantly. So once sharing the project, of course, you can open another project and then once it's saved, the collaborators will able to see that too. And if it doesn't update, you can go back to your my project category and then open it back again like that. Awesome. But we are not done yet. So one of the most important things in this collab project like this is communication. And there's an inbuilt chat box for this reason. On the top right, you'll see who's online. And next to it is the chat icon. Click on it and voila. A simple but incredibly responsive chat box. You can even resize it to fit your needs. Huge shout out to all the developers who made this possible. So let's type it and I can see it's really responsive and no such delay in between. And let's say you're done and you want to keep things to yourself. You don't want anyone to edit because you can't trust friends. And that's where the unleak feature comes in. You can go to your My Stuff category and it will show an unleak feature on every project you share. Really cool. Unfortunately, Scratch is still Scratch. So if you want more robust features like more extensions, more blocks, well, you can check out my video on Gandhi IDE. So yeah, I'll see you there.